Hi, welcome to Yoga and You. I'm Divya Rolla. In the last episode, we were getting ourselves ready for the seated and the standing forward bends by really stretching our hamstrings and our calf muscles. Today, we are going to proceed in the same direction except we are going to add one more element to it that is making sure that we really stretch our groin and we are going to add a few hip openers to it. We are going to start by lying down on the mat and all you will require again is a simple strap or you can use a dupatta or a rope which is available at home. So for this posture, you are going to again lie down on your back. Make sure your feet are really pressed against the wall, hip width apart and parallel. Don't let your feet roll out. Wrap it around the midpoint of your foot and lie down. Readjust so that your feet are being pressed into the mat. As you inhale, stay in position. As you exhale, slowly lift the leg up, making sure the other leg is pressing down into the mat. Your shoulders and neck are relaxed and your toes are pointed towards you. From here, on the next exhalation, start opening your leg completely to the right. Making sure the heel is pointing up towards the ceiling, the little toe is pointing down. Keep your neck straight and really press the opposite leg into the wall and into the mat. Now stay here, 10 deep breaths. Keeping the knees locked and once again, as you exhale, come up and slowly release back down. So what we just did is another variation of Supta Padagustasana. Here the stretch you will feel is a very deep stretch in your hamstring, your calf muscle but at the same time it stretches the entire inner thigh muscles. So you have to make sure that your knees are completely locked, the foot against the wall is really pushing into the wall and all the toes are pointing towards you so that your feet is in a flexed position and not in a point position.